What's going on everyone? My name is Wally Reed, don't care what my name is, and here we go with my reaction for a new death battle fight between Hercules and Sun Wukong, aka Monkey King. So, we have Greek mythology versus Chinese mythology. No anime, no comics, no video games, nope, this is directly from their uh, respective mythology going against one another. This is the first time we're actually seeing that with death battle, and I'm very happy with it. I cannot wait to see who's going to win this. Um... So yeah, let's get, let's get started. I don't own anything from this. It's owned by Death Battle, which is owned by Rooster Teeth. So let's get started and see what we got. Oh. Our tale begins atop a great mountain where the mighty Heracles sought a gift from the gods. This is actually pretty different. That's cool. Oh there. Huh? I'm in need of that apple. Relinquish it. Sorry, I'm supposed to find my master some vegetarian food. You'll find it elsewhere. But Heracles was not so easily fooled. <laughs> there we go. Oh wow, this is actually a pretty good animation. But he's not so easily overwhelmed the god of strength. That's narration too. Oh, broke that sword. I am Heracles! Oh, he's at him. Oh! Call the scroll to go up. Oh, he's pretty fast. Oh, damn. Die, demon. Agony. Agony. The yeah. Monkey King fell into a strange forest in awe at such a wondrous fight. <laughs> but should he mistake his fear, he <clears throat> might lose his head. Yeah, but he's not dead. I haven't had such fun since I fought all of heaven. Change! Behold me! The immortal monkey king! <laughs> Multiple heads. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that brings back memories, I'm sure. Ooh, damn! Yeah, that's not gonna stop him, dude. Fun beast, but I've had enough. Ooh, okay. Wait, what's going on? The heavens above, the gods witnessed their earthbound selves, and so joined in that. Really? The god of strength mustered the hearts of Olympus. While the great sage harnessed power equal to heaven. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. The monkey king emerged victorious. Really? Wow. Wow, would you look at that? I struck him so hard he was reduced to nothingness. <laughs> With a formidable foe slain, stricken against the mountain's breast, so ends our great tale. Of East and West. That was not bad. Well done. KO! Talk about a Herculean matchup! Heracles was among the greatest heroes in myth, but the great sage equal to heaven held many more advantages. You'd think Sun might not measure up to the god of strength, you know, strength, but he totally could. Yeah. Remember, he carried Sumeru on his back, the mountain holding up the infinite celestial sky. One shoulder. Like how Heracles held up the infinite celestial sphere. As befitting heroes of myth, they were on par in that they were both incomprehensibly strong. However, Wukong's healing abilities meant he could bounce back from Heracles' deadliest blows, whereas Heracles did not have a similar option. Yeah. But Heracles did have one way of putting the Monkey King down. 
His heroes dipped in Hydra poison. The Hydra poison threatened even the gods of Olympus, similar to the Scorpion Sting. Whether or not it would be fatal is questionable, but it could have incapacitated Wukong, similar to how it affected Heracles himself. But that is one very specific wind condition, and we're looking at this with every possible option in mind. With his variety of clones, transformations, and numerous other spells, Wukong's arsenal was far more versatile. Like, there was nothing stopping him from making thousands of clones of himself and just sitting back while they beat up Herc for him. Unsportsmanlike? Sure. In character? Absolutely. This is a smart then, move, too. Arrows would have to actually strike Wukong, which would be extremely difficult. Yes, in some depictions, Heracles could potentially shoot the son of Helios, his arrows flying 90 times the speed of light. What? However, in his contest <clears throat> with the Buddha, Wukong leapt to the edge of the universe in a single second. To do so, he had to be moving over 1.4 quintillion times yeah. faster than light, making him way faster than her could ever hope to be. Heracles held might of mythic proportions, but barring a lucky shot, Sun Wukong's versatile magic, similar strength, and absolutely absurd speed overcame this foe, fitting for heaven's equal. When fighting Sun Wukong, Heracles missed his chance. The winner is the Monkey King, Sun Wukong. Awesome. Alright, who's next? Oh, Boba? Okay. Wait, no! Yes! Ah, yes! Alright, so that was the fight, and I really enjoyed how well this went. Not just because of the animation, which I thought they did a great job with, but also the voice actors as well. They got to voice these characters. I was very happy to look up this information about Sun Wukong and how... Yeah, I mean, this guy has a lot more abilities and tricks up his sleeves than anything Hercules had. I mean, Hercules has gone against some very powerful foes. Uh, but nothing like what Su Sun Wukong has gone through. I mean, that he's battled heaven in, in itself. That's impressive. And I, I kind of had a feeling Sun Wukong was going to win this, but I still liked how the fight went and how both these guys were pretty much almost equal in power. But it was just not enough. Not enough for them to, uh, for Hercules to overcome. And the next death battle fight, that's, that's a dream fight that we've been waiting to see. Boba Fett versus the Predator. Awesome. I can't wait to see how that's going to go. I really don't know who's going to win that, but either way, only the best hunter will walk out victorious. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you have a different opinion about this death battle fight or what you think of the next one, leave some comments below. Let me know what you think. Hit the subscribe button. Check out my Facebook page. Check out my Twitter page. Check out T3 Media's channel. Take out, check out Death Pat, a Battle. Sorry. Rooster T's channel. Subscribe to their channels. Keep up to date with their videos. And I'll see you next time. Give you more love and more entertainment. Until then, take care. Be safe. Love you all. Goodbye.